and another video on how to repair these because uh, today two of these boards burned don't know why uh, suddenly the first and when the second was running for for a few seconds and then also i maybe that's what i would like to know because uh, here these uh, connectors to the motors uh, the current cables um, had a high resistance and so maybe um, there was not the current flowing that the controller expected and uh, so here these i unsold it because both have um, all both have had a shortcut and so that's a shortcut from plus to minus uh, here this board is still running you can hear it but i will not show you the motor you, you hear it and just to show you here do you see that's uh you see here that's uh, 36 volt and so this is a high side mosfet and this is a gate and even so the motor is not spinning uh, the gate is uh, making a pvm of 50 uh, 50 50 ratio uh, sorry up to 63 volts that's because um, it's an uh, end channel uh, but, but on the high side so you must create a voltage the gate must get a voltage that's 30 14 volt higher than the 40 volts so or 45 so 62 volt that's why it's such a high voltage how however it is generated this is a, a cable one of the phases to the motor it's really also getting high and low voltage but if you can see here uh, if you just notice here the, the position all three phases have exactly the same uh, phase shift and therefore no current is flowing even so um, there's a full 36 volt uh, pvm here on these three phases and and so this is these is a motor connected it's uh, here is also a motor connected but uh, not working so the second here is again here the middle pin so this is the high side and here that's the gate uh, and, and this is the output and here that's the gate and now I want to know if here this gate driver is also outputting uh, this high voltage and it is uh, here but you can here see this peak but I think that's okay because here there's no MOSFET inside and therefore the gate capacity uh, is not um, sucking in the sp spike and so uh, it's this looks good uh, that um, I can solder in uh, another uh, MOSFET from another broken board and and so here this is a low side and so let's take here a look at the low side where to see here that's a gate you see that's a, a low side end channel so you only need 14 volt uh, to, to open it uh, and so let's take here the same position here and I think we, we will get here yeah, we will get the same uh, gate here so the resistor is also showing the gate and, and so here you see there's the resistor and can you see something here <laughs> uh, sorry I did not look at the camera so you can check the, the gate here also at, at the resistor and so uh, both gate drivers seem to be okay so I would like to know why uh, why did these uh, why did these two MOSFETs blow uh, okay there's uh, this is, uh, no hoverboard motors connected but uh, once the 2000 watt scooter motors so with, with higher rest but uh, I'm checking with you are I'm checking the the amps and they only draw 250 watt uh, each motor and so 350 watt motors for 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 this hoverboard and so uh, um, yesterday they were running out of and, and today two times this and the other on the other board also uh, two MOSFET uh, so one one channel uh, did blue and so i will check it's the same but here i it's it's looking good that i can solder in uh, some 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 new mosfets and uh, i really you see i might uh, might be willing to to replace all these mosfets if if they get uh, have a better rating uh, you see a lower uh, resi resistance on uh, rds on on resistance and
Yes. So you see, I salvaged completely. This was, uh, the, I, I did burn it because I did forget about my absolute beginner. <laughs> this was a board where the uh, plus, plus and minus was opposite. And so I was lucky that only this board burned and not the ESP and everything else be, uh, connected to it. And so you see lots now, lots of MOSFET here. And so indeed uh, these two MOSFETs, if you can check that the gate uh, is still behaving like the other gates, then it's okay to solder in uh, some other MOSFETs. But uh, you see, please, in the comment section, I would like to know why why do they burn? Uh, is it overcurrent, over voltage? Is it, is it spikes? Um, are there better ones that I can solder in? Because you see here with my uh, huge bandsaw uh, and the two fringe saws uh, before, and so it's a lot of work and I would really, I, I would spend uh, one or two hours to to replace uh, all these MOSFETs or to improve here uh, something. Uh, to, so if, if, yeah, please, uh, some ideas you see uh, how, how I can protect these MOSFETs. Bye-bye. <clears throat>